Now, barrenness simply means fruitless efforts. That is the real meaning of barrenness. It could be barrenness in the physical, like a woman and the husband, they have tried and tried and there's no result. It could be barrenness in the material. You have been walking like an elephant and you have been eating like a rat. Some of us have been walking for years. There's nothing to show for it. Like in the case of Peter, who fished all night and caught nothing. Barren. It could be barrenness in the academic. As a matter of fact, when I was in the university, if there is a lecturer who is working very hard, but he couldn't publish papers, we will say he is academically barren. I decree today that in whatever area you are barren, your barrenness will come to an end. I mean, you, 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 you find a man of God who is fasting, praying, studying the word, preaching, doing everything, but the church refuses to grow. We call that one barrenness. Ah, in the name that's above every other name, I say to every minister of God here, your barrenness ends today. Yes. When God remembers you, he puts an end to your barrenness. Yes. 